guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be talking about my baptism. So Five years ago I asked Jesus into my heart and then I decided to get baptized. It was very chaotic because um, my pastor had to go to the hospital and then my mom had an allergic reaction so she had to go home and was on FaceTime during my baptism. And if you're scared to get baptized, like I said, my baptism day was very chaotic. I was really scared and nervous, but I realized it wasn't actually that bad. And so, um, if I realized it hadn't been that bad, I wouldn't be posting this on YouTube. We're glad that you stayed with us today with everything that's been going on. It's a very special occasion. For all involved and as we come to this point it needs to be recognized that this is something that God planned for his people it's more than just being dumped in the water it's a testimony of things that have happened in Addie's life because of God reaching out to her. A baptism is a significant testimony of the reception of Jesus Christ as her personal Savior and Lord. When she is placed under water, it is a testimony that the Holy Spirit has come upon her life and brought her life under his power and under his authority. When she's raised from the water, it is a testimony of a new life hidden in Christ and to be lived with and for Christ is a testimony of a life now that is eternal, not one that would come to an end. Jesus set us a great example when he came to John the Baptist to be baptized. And John the Baptist told him, I, I, I'm not worthy to baptize you. But Jesus told John, it behooves us to fulfill all righteousness. When Jesus started preaching, his preaching was of a repentance of turning from sin and turning to God. The, his baptism was a baptism not only of repentance, but a baptism into life with God for all eternity. <coughs> We've come today to pay not truth, but to recognize the authority of God through Jesus Christ, his son, to bring us to repentance and not to stop there, but to bring us into a new life because of the indwelling presence of the Holy Spirit when we receive Jesus Christ personally as our Lord and Savior. Let's pray. Father, as we come today, we thank you that you give us the opportunity of testimony of your goodness, your grace, your love for us. We thank you for the testimony of Addison today as she comes to be baptized. Father, may be this a celebration of a new life in you. May she understand and know that this is a commitment that she is making to live for and with you. We praise you. We thank you. In Jesus' name, amen. Addison Elise Kleinsor.
He's being baptized in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. She's being raised to testimony, a new life which she has now in Christ. And everybody said, Amen. Amen. God bless you, Addison. Thank you guys for watching, and please like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And hit the notification bell so that you can get notifications every time I post a new video.